Hi, I'm Gabriella. I'm a Kids First alumna, and today I'm here with Sophie, who's the star of the movie The Book Thief. Can you start by giving me a short introduction of your character, Liesl? Um, so I play Liesl in The Book Thief, and she's been adopted by the character of Jeffrey Rush and Emily Watson. And at the beginning of the movie, she doesn't really know how to read or write, but she's going to discover that with the help of her adopted father. And you're going to see how she develops this different, um, how she's going to ha have a special connection with her adoptive father and her adoptive mother and all her friends. So what do you want your audience to learn from watching your character? Um, how you have to always see positive things in every bad situation and how you can discover hope in every book. And I actually hope that children are going to try to read a little bit more and to see that to try to learn a bit more about the story of the Holocaust and try to um, always see the bright side and never give up on their dreams. So is this what drew you into acting, like conveying such a positive message? or? Um, I actually was a gymnast before and I got into the, um, an agency because I wanted money to pay for gymnastics and I just got some roles and some commercials and that my that was one of my first big role and I said I want to take it because I really liked my character in the story and that's why I became an actress. That's really cool. So what was um, your favorite part about playing Liesl? Um, it was that I, could, I had a lot, of, I could identify easily with the character and I really liked the whole story and also because I could learn a lot just by doing the movie just getting to read all these stories and see all these movies and I can learn a lot. What was the hardest part about playing Liesl? Um, I think the last scene at the end, it's, it's, it, for the people that didn't see, it's a really emotional scene. And um, it was a hard day to shoot because I had to cry a lot. But at the end of the day, I was really happy. Do you have a favorite scene? Um, yes, the snowball fight scene. Uh, it's when it's Christmas and everybody's throwing snowballs and it's just really fun because everybody on set was really happy. Mm -hmm. um, if you could redo your experience playing Liesl and um, being with the cast of the movie, would you do anything differently? I don't think so because I had just an amazing experience and I could learn just so much by watching them both Emily and Jeffrey act and by being with the crew and all these special moments that we have so I wouldn't do anything differently. Um, so if what was the most insightful thing you learned from Emily and Jeffrey? Um, that there's kind of two different types of actors and Jeffrey's a bit more, he could get in and out of character really easily. So one time he could be in his character and then the minute after he could be doing a joke or doing a magic trick and Emily is really focused and stays into character the whole time and is really, really smart. In every scene, she always tries to see why is her character doing this and what is the character think thinking and every little detail. Do you guys play any games when you're on set or is it just strictly sticking to the movie? Um, no, we always have jokes, we play games, we do games with our hands. Um, when we're not shooting, me and Nico, the guy that plays Rudy, we play cards, we play, um, we draw, we play all these like hang, like all these like tic-tac-toe and all these different games. Do you also do that in your free time or? Um, I do that but I mostly dance or I watch TV and sometimes I go outside and play with my sister. What kind of dancing do you like to do? Um, hip hop or, well I mean it's kind of free because I just turn the music on and I dance how I yeah, feel like it. Too. <laughs> um, what kind of um, TV shows do you like? I like, um, right now I'm watching Gossip Girl, so that's what I'm watching right now. And, and we're in New York. <laughs> yeah. And um, Pretty Little Liars is my favorite mm -hmm. show right now. Um, so do you have any plans for the future? Um, well, my next role is a movie called The Great Gilly Hopkins. It's going to be shot in April here in New York. And... Uh, I just continue reading some scripts and see what I like and continue going to school. How is that different from The Book Thief? Um, well, they're both, um, my two characters are both um, 
She's my the my next character. She's an adoptive girl that moves from different foster homes, mm -hmm. and actually, I think they're quite similar because they're both they're never gonna give up on their dream and they're really strong mind characters. Um, but I think the other the the great Gilly Hopkins is a bit more uh, sensible and cares. A, yeah, I actually think they're pretty much alike. <laughs> yeah, and um, you're in New York too, and I know you're from Canada originally. So, like, have you been doing any cool activities here, or how are you liking it? Um, I love New York because I always found it's like Canada, but in a much, like, in a way bigger. And I love the like, people here and just how I've done um, city bus, like touring on a bus. And just seeing, I went on the Brooklyn Bridge and I went walking and doing bicycle in the Central Park. That's really cool. Um, I have no more questions, but I really like getting to know you. Thank you. Yeah.